The overall goal of this procedure is to simultaneously measure receptor ligand binding and to observe the binding-induced calcium signaling on a single cell. This is accomplished by first isolating, biotinylating, and adjusting the osmolarity of human red blood cells, or RBCs, to use them as an ultra-sensitive force transducer. The second step is to functionalize microscale glass beads, which includes cleaning, thiolation, and ligand coating. Next, the T-cells are isolated and incubated with the calcium dye Fura 2 am which enables the observation of intracellular calcium ion concentration. The final step is to prepare the micropipettes in experimental chamber that are specially required for the experiment setup. Ultimately, the fluorescence biomembrane force probe or BFP technique is used to show the adhesion of a cell to a ligand coated bead, measure the receptor ligand binding kinetics, and meanwhile monitor the intracellular calcium level. This technique is useful in understanding how mechanical force is sensed by T cells via antigen recognition. A major advantage of this technique over existing methods is that FBAP can measure receptor ligand binding kinetics and intracellular signaling simultaneously. The challenging parts of this protocol include manually producing micropipettes of the correct diameters, picking up cells and beads with micropipettes, and assembling the force probe, which can fail.